Hey everyone, thanks for clicking on my video. Uh, I'm seeing this news article circle around. I want to address it because I'm part of the whole, uh, you know, side hustle gig. So let's talk about this. <laughs> your first time to my channel and you want to uh, grow be a better delivery driver make sure you hit that subscribe button hit the notification bell you won't miss any of my awesome content so what I'm talking about is uh, right down there and you probably already read the title um, actually probably all the uh, rideshare people are probably posting about this right now I don't typically deal with the rideshare vehicle uh, news unless it's kind of prevalent and I think this is kind of prevalent because I, I wanted to fact check this. It says that rideshare vehicles contain 35,000 times more germs than toilet seats. Now, the study was done by a company called NetQuote. And um, what they do is they use a unit of measurement called the CFU. And that's the colony forming units. And that's the, So it's called fecal bacteria, meaning like, um, like raw meat and stuff, like bacteria that sits on that. It, it excretes fecal matter. And then um, that's how you get it. And they... It's called the uh, CFU, Colony Forming Units, uh, were found per square inch on the surface of rideshare. So this is per square inch. This is pretty gross. So a, toilet's, a toilet seat measured 171.65 CFU, while a rideshare car contained a whopping 6.055, almost 6.056 million CFU, uh, and that is... 35,000 times uh, more than a toilet seat. Now, I was like, well, maybe the base, the, the toilet seat is wrong because that seems so low. And come to find out, no, it's it's totally right. So I began reading a couple of these articles about don't touch the remote and the dirty spots in hotels room. And they typically quote a bath, uh, the actual toilet itself to be between 150 and 200 CFU, depending on the hotel that was you know studied. So 171 actually seems like a really good number to, to get. Now, just so you understand the concept of 6 million, 6.056 million CFU, a bathroom counter, or we already established 150 for a toilet. That's I would assume that's because they're coming in and cleaning that toilet almost daily. I mean, they probably assume it's a crazy hazard, so they're just constantly cleaning it. So it makes sense that that number would be lower. A bathroom counter is 1.288 million CFU. A remote is 1.211 CFU, uh, 1. 1. 1.21 gigawatts. But yeah, it's 1.21 million. So I remember the remote, I remember when the remote was the scare back in the day. A desk is 614,000 CFU. And uh, a phone is 4,252. So even Fido's dog bowl is only like 2,100 bacteria per square inch. So now we go back to 6 million CFU, over 6 million. Oh, it's so gross. It's so gross. And it makes perfect sense to me. Hold on one second. It makes sense because, I mean, really, there's no standard for these rideshare gigs. They just drive their cars, and I'm sure they vacuum their cars out, but there's no sanitation going on. People are sneezing into the back seats, and they're they're doing all kinds of gross stuff. And, you know, honestly, I bet there's probably people wiping boogers and, and all that stuff. And, and you know, rideshare guy doesn't want to spend a lot more money on sanitation and all that. Now, I have these bags. And I wash them like every two days I wash them. And I do that because I'm constantly putting food in and out. And I assume there's going to be bacteria. So, you know, it's important to take our bags and actually wash them. Uh, I like to do mine on cold. And I like to do a low tumble so I don't damage the inner thermal lining. Um, and I like to do like, like a lower heat. But in our cars, we should be cleaning them as well. I mean, it's pretty stinking gross that that number is that high. That's embarrassing. And, you know, that's just going to bring down more scrutiny and all that stuff. Um, so, yeah, they said that even a, a taxi cab didn't even uh, go that high. They were like 600,000 or something. And, 
and we're six, well, I'm not, I, I don't do ride share. I don't like people in my car, but for all you people that have people in your car, maybe uh, now's the time to start uh, cleaning the pillars, <laughs> all these plastic uh, pillars, uh, hit this stuff with something. I don't even know what you can use to get, to disinfect like cloth seats and stuff. Like leather, obviously I understand, like you could just use some like, some like sanitation wipes, but yeah, you know, figure it out guys, this is embarrassing. And uh, I just wanted to report on it and to just kind of dispel any myths. And because um, I remember, like I said, the remote control thing was a big scare not too long ago. And I kind of wanted to use that as the reference point because there was a lot of data taken around that and it's pretty current. But yeah, that's so gross. I'm really glad I don't use Rideshare. I never have. But definitely if you do use Rideshare, um, maybe some hand sanitizer, maybe just take a shower. If you like the video and you wanna see more content, definitely subscribe, hit the notification bell. If you wanna start driving for Postmates, here's my code. If you wanna start driving for Postmates, then go ahead and just use my code right here. Or likewise, in every single one of my videos, you can click the link to get signed up using my code and they'll let you know what the bonus is at the time of signing up. This shows me a ton of support and you don't have to pay for any monthly Patreon or anything like that. You just get a bonus for doing some deliveries, make some money. It helps me out and I continue making great content. So thank you for supporting me and I'll see you on the road.